Hi and welcome Aquarius, Rose Burnett here, Mind Body Soul Balance. This is your mid-month tarot forecast for July 2021. Now it is a general reading, so as trust yourself what resonates, leave what does not. Big welcome to those of you that are new to my channel. Awesome to have you here and those that follow me regularly, you're rocking awesome, love your support. There is a competition happening again in July, so there's some beautiful Oracle decks up for grabs. So to enter, all you need to be is a new subscriber to my channel or opt into the extended versions of my readings. So you'll go into the draw to win the beautiful Kunyin Oracle by Lana Fairchild, be drawing someone randomly. And for those that have been following me for a while, be looking for a very positive community member, you'll go into the draw to win the uh, Messenger Oracle, which dare I say is a deck I use all the time. It's amazing. And I'll announce the winners at the end of the month on my channel. And the June winners have been announced, so uh, I need you to get in touch. So I'm going to run your names across the bottom of the screen. So Anne Curran won for new subscribers and Noe Ricardo won for existing members. So uh, details on how to get in touch is in the description below. You just need to shoot me an email to claim your prize. And to get the extended versions of my readings, pretty simple. Just hit the join button on my channel or the very first link in the description box below. They're only $5.99 a month. You get the extended version of this reading, the mid-month, as well as the monthly and a bonus monthly love reading. And they're deeply transformational, motivational, inspirational. We dive a whole lot deeper into your energies and guidance from spirit. So if you want to invest in yourself every month, go and check those out. My personal readings are open, so if you feel like you need extra support and guidance, reach out. There's a coupon offer this month. You can get $10 off my readings. going to pop up here as well as down below, as well as all the booking info. And follow me on Instagram. I do a lot of daily motivation, inspiration over there that you won't see on YouTube. So come and say hi. All right, Aquarius, let's get started. So we're diving straight into predictions using the uh, Angel Wisdom Tarot. And let's see what you need to know. Oh, this is gorgeous. You've got the two of water, which represents the two of cups. Yeah, it's beautiful love, mutual love between each other, offering each other your cups. There's an angel over, overhead representing Cupid's arrow. So there's a beautiful home in the background. It can represent you love. It can represent overcoming challenges in a current relationship uh, to come to this beautiful mutual love and deepening of commitment. Uh, you've also got the two of fire, which is partnering up with others with a shared vision towards the future. They're both looking off to the future. One's holding the world in his hands. So working together collaboratively with others on your goals, your dreams. And you've got the eight of air. So just watch this. It's just a feeling of being stuck. It's all about the ego, yeah? States of illusion, mental thought processes holding you stuck from going after what it is you want. And you've got the sun coming out, yeah, which is this beautiful shift in positive energy, renewed hope, optimism. There's um, someone in the background riding a horse with a flag, which represents victory. can certainly be your plans working out perfectly, even if it doesn't feel like it. Spirit's saying they will. I mean, we always co-create that. <laughs> okay, that one's flying out. Oh, you've got the Empress. She's very nurturing energy. It's all about giving birth to your dreams, going after what it is that you want. It's going to bring in your abundance, your prosperity, if you trust yourself. You've also got release. So letting go of anything that's holding you back in life, yeah? Things that have happened in the past, just let them go, Aquarius, yeah? Open up to new beginnings in your life. And you've also got the seven of fire, which is standing up for yourself, doing what's right for you. Um, sometimes it's about, you know, it can represent conflict with others. So choosing your battles wisely, knowing when to walk away, whether to, when to stand up for yourself. And you've also got the justice card. So if you're going through anything illegal in this, uh, in the syst legal system, um, in terms of waiting on things to come through, settlements coming through, it's very much that it will be handled in a fair and just manner as long as you act with integrity, honesty, do your part. It can also represent karmic justice. Oh, 
Wow, you've got the nine of fire again, protecting that which you've created, not giving up, spirit saying, don't give up at this point. You're too close to success. And you've got the four of water. So it's about focusing on the negative, focusing on the spilt cups versus the opportunities around you. There's an angel behind him trying to offer him a cup, but he can't see it yet. So just watching how you're looking at things, your perception of things. All right, let's put some guidance from the Moose Tarot. You've got the Hermit, which is going within to seek your spiritual guidance, trusting yourself, time is self-discovery, figuring out what's right for you. Well, right next to it, you've got your, the Priestess, which is seeking your spiritual guidance, lots of signs, synchronicities from the universe, trusting the guidance that's coming through to you. And you've got the Knight of Materials, which is doing the hard work to co-create with the universe, to create your abundance flows, take an action. And you've got the Four of Emotions, which again is very much looking backward, focusing on the past, on things that haven't turned out. Spirit's saying, how can you, one, stop recycling through things from the past, but put them in more of a positive aspect in terms of what strength did you come out with, what did you learn about self? what you need to release and just let go of. Oh, this is gorgeous. you got the Ten of Materials, which is this beautiful abundance, prosperity, creating a financial legacy for your family, for the future. It can also be generations to come, not only in material wealth, but also from whatever you're contributing back to humanity. Very beautiful. Directly related to giving birth to your dreams. All right, let's put you some angel healing messages. Oh, you've got adventure. It says instead of seeing the current situation as an obstacle, try seeing it as an adventure. Explore all the possibilities. There are many more than you currently imagine. Instead of seeing things as either black or white, try to explore all the colours in between. So meaning that there's not just one way to solve an issue or to work through something. Oh, you've also got fear. <laughs> I, Archangel Michael, I'm here to help you through the present time. I love you, I protect you and keep you safe. Trust all is well. Accept my love and allow it to dissolve your fear. Directly to, related to those of you feeling a bit stuck yeah, and focusing on the negative. And you've also got integrity. Be flexible but also be true to you. Stand by your beliefs and values and others will stand by and believe in you. Almost like the third message coming out about that. Just in your predictions. All right, let's put you some guidance from the Journey of Love Oracle. Oh, wow. You've pulled heaven. I've got to be honest with you, I don't think this card's ever come out before. Let's pull you up the guidance. It says, Aquarius, you are meant to live heaven, not later, sometime after you die. What use is life and body if not meant to live heaven now? Look for the mad divine genius in all that is, especially the puzzling parts of your life that make you scratch your head, tear out your hair or scrunch up your face and scream with frustration. Those are the places in which the divine is saying, here, heaven is hiding. Let's unveil it together. Let me show you. Let me unveil your own mad divine genius right here. Look for heaven even in hiding. It will not withhold itself from you for long, beloved. It wants to be known by you. So this oracle brings you a special message. The enlightener is calling for you to more, more, more. More divinity, more love, more acceptance, more embrace of life itself. There is no limit in what is being offered to you from the divine lover calling to you. 
Rejoice and know that this is the dance of love between you and the divine and removing all veils of illusion one at a time until you behold each other naked and true finally discover that you are each other you are love so it's saying that within any challenge or anything you're going through yes it's, it's supposed to help you not hinder you and there's a poem here it says the sky ablaze with morning light on silver wings of birds in flight in gratitude a tear released a knowingness embraced as peace she speaks to those that gaze below ancestral wings which call my soul to open hearts and soar above in all the winds await this love very much spiritual angels spirit guides watching over you at this time mm -hmm. all right my love so are your messages love to hear your feedback your comments down below if you liked it hit the like button hit the subscribe button so helps my channel it does mm -hmm. Now we're going into the uh, extended version of this reading next. There's this beautiful love going on here, mutual love, beautiful home in the background. There's certainly the ability to partner up with others as well as nurture your dreams, give birth to your dreams. Um, there's this amazing transformation going on. Dare I say for some of you it's working through challenges, yeah. And this beautiful creating a financial legacy for the future also around your goals your dreams and we'll see what else comes out in the general energies around career finances love moving through stuck states and higher guidance from spirit so if you want to get a hold of that just hit the join button on my channel very first link in the description box below those of you leaving us right now been awesome to have you here make sure to come back again vip members those going into the extended hang around we're going into your general energies next Thank you.